At least 40 people have lost their lives in the southern Indian state of Kerala, where heavy floods triggered by heavier rains and landslides have now wreaked havoc on the state. Two districts, Kotayam and Iduki, have been the worst affected in the state. The Indian Med Department has issued an orange alert for all districts except Kanur and Kasaragod. Disaster relief operations are operating full-time in Kerala. The National Disaster Response Force has been deployed in at least 11 districts of the state. Two teams of the Indian Army have also been deployed. Meanwhile, the gates of the Iduki Dam were opened up by the local authorities. This was to ease the pressure on the structure in the wake of heavy rainfall. This is the fourth time that the shutters of Asia's largest arc dam have been opened. Until now, the gates have only been opened in the years 1981, 1992 and 2018. Kerala's chief minister has urged people of the state to exercise extreme caution. Steps are being taken to shift people to safer locations with dams being reopened. The number of relief camps have now been increased to 240. In 2018, nearly 500 people were killed in Kerala when it was ravaged by the worst floods to hit the state in almost a century. Climate change in the region seems to have a direct effect on the rain patterns in Kerala. Earlier June and July brought rainfall to the state in the past, but now spells of very heavy and frequent rain are witnessed in August and September. Extreme rainfall has become a norm in the state, leading to massive flash floods. This comes as climate change has made natural disasters a seasonal phenomenon in India. Meanwhile, heavy rainfall in Uttarakhand has led to chaos and disaster across the state. At least 20 people have lost their lives due to heavy rains. Roads and buildings in the state are completely flooded, leaving locals and tourists stranded some even in remote, lo remote locations. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi spoke to the Uttarakhand Chief Minister, taking stock of the situation. The Indian Med Department has now issued a red alert for Uttarakhand with a forecast of heavy rainfall. The State Disaster Response Force in Uttarakhand has teams conducting rescue operations. Extreme rainfall has become a norm in India, leading to massive flash floods. This comes as climate change has made natural disasters a seasonal phenomenon. In India, the southwest monsoon usually begins in the first week of June. This extends up to September in some states. A second smaller wave of rain begins in some states in October, often referred to as the retreating monsoon. But in recent years, the natural schedule has been completely thrown off guard. States across the country are receiving heavy rainfall, leading to loss of life and damage to public property and infrastructure. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.